Hello, 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 and welcome to Car Talk with Steph. Today, I wanted to talk to you about grounding and how beneficial and supportive it can be to really create a solid grounding practice for when you find yourself going through experiences or situations that can cause you like discomfort if you end up triggered or you're overstressed, overwhelmed, like different things like that. And when you end up in these spaces of massive overwhelm, what is your go-to for really helping you come back into your center, to really allowing you to ground down and let go of other people's beliefs and perspectives and opinions, just to really let you feel okay and empowered and confident within you. So what I like to do, and it's honestly super, super easy. So, I mean, grounding yourself throughout your day is very beneficial as a crow flies over my window to land in the tree. Um, grounding yourself throughout your day multiple times a day and calling your power back can really help you with not feeling drained all the time, really just refreshing your own energy and your own mindsets and perspectives and just where you are. So one of the big things that I love to do is even just taking a couple of moments, I usually will put my left hand first, my right hand over top. If you feel called to do it the opposite way, trust your intuition. I do it this way because my left is my feminine energy. So I receive from my left and I give with my right because that's my masculine energy. And so your masculine and feminine energy is all about that giving and receiving. So you put your left hand over top and then your right hand, or so you put your left hand down, your right hand over top. I usually will close my eyes and I'll take one big breath in. Hold it in my mind for about four seconds. And as I'm holding it in my mind, it's almost like I take that breath and almost like floss it through my brain as I set the intention to cleanse and release. And then as I'm holding it, I allow it to do that cleansing. And as I exhale, I wash and let it go. So it's almost like I, I visualize all of that energy that my breath is cleansing out of my brain, kind of getting wrapped in like water droplets. And then I roll it down my body to go back to Mother Earth. And then I do this three times. And as I do so, I go through all time, space, dimensions, and realities. I call my power back to me now. And you can snap your fingers if you would like that, like, through all time, space, dimensions, and realities, I call my power back to me now in this present moment. And that process, what it does is it reaches out through every experience that you have had where you've given your power away and it allows you that space to call it back to you. And then I do this, sometimes it might take like two or three times to do it, uh, as many times as you feel like necessary, until you start to feel lighter, until you start to feel more empowered. And then what I do is I ground my energy and give what is no longer serving me back to Mother Earth. And then I'll take my hands and I'll place them down so that you can give your energy back to Mother Earth, which is then going to fill you back up and ground you back into that center of self. 
So I hope this helped. If you would like to drop in the comments your experience, how you felt with it, I would love to hear from you. And I hope you're having a beautiful day. I'm just resting today. Market yesterday was insanely crazy and fabulous, but I am tired. So have a wonderful and beautiful day and I will chat with y'all soon. Mwah. Thank you. Bye.